our tank safety. Uh, first of all, we have a vacuum breaker up here. Uh, as you can see, I don't want to push on this, but if I push on this, water would shoot out. Uh, the design behind this is if uh, there's ever back siphoning from the tank, so if water is pulled back from the tank through the piping and back into the main for some reason, this would open, the spring would pop down, and it would pull air in to the water line and pull air back. And that would stop the tank from sucking in and imploding, basically. Uh, the next feature we have here is a TMP, uh, temperature and pressure relief valve. Uh, this is designed that if the hot water in the tank comes up to too high of a temperature or if the pressure inside the tank builds too high, it will actually open and it will shoot water out down this piping and uh, onto the floor in this situation. Some are piped into a uh, floor drain, uh, but this right here is minimally, minimally what you would like. Um, you don't want the water shooting out at chest level or head level and uh, uh, spraying you in the face, that would be very hot and very dangerous. Uh, you want to check for corrosion around the fittings, make sure there's no corrosion here, no water sitting here, same with the electrical. Uh, you want to make sure there's no water or corrosion around the electrical, make sure everything's tight, make sure it's grounded properly. Down here, this tank's an electric tank, so we have our rating plate, our warranty information, serial number, etc. are here. At the bottom, uh, we have a drain. Uh, this tank also has a piping capability of sending the cold water piping. Instead of piping it in up here, uh, we could pipe it in down here. Uh, we've chosen not to do this and capped it off. Uh, right here is your drain valve. You can connect a garden hose uh, to this assembly. Use a screwdriver, flathead, and just open this up, and that will drain the tank out. Uh, it can be done sort of once a year to maybe flush it for a minute or so just to remove any sediment and debris in the bottom of the tank. It will help your heating performance.